Hi folks, I have a quick video for you today. It's more of a public service announcement. This may not apply to too many of you, but I thought it was important to get this message out there. Three days ago, I learned that somebody had impersonated my identity on Instagram. Not only that, they had reached out to the few followers that I had and started asking for money. Now, I immediately, as soon as I learned, reached out to Instagram itself to complain that somebody had hacked my account. What I discovered was the hacker had already had me delete it from Instagram. So I've had no recourse at all from Instagram. There's nothing I can do about this situation, yet the hacker is still impersonating me on Instagram. Now, what I'm going to do is put a screenshot on the screen somewhere, one side or the other here, to show you what it looks like. If you have been a follower of me on Instagram, you'll know that the page looks identical, virtually identical, to what I had posted. The only difference being is at the top of the page, instead of seeing the name Mark Young Bushcraft, you're going to see the identity 10101 Jacob So. If you get reach, if any, if that person reaches out to you and asks for money, it's not me. It is a fraud. It is a scam, and I highly recommend that you not pay them any attention. I have nothing I can do about what the situation. Uh, there was no way I could have prevented it, and Instagram is not going to help me out on this. You have to understand, Instagram is a business, and we are not the customers. We are the commodity. So there's an acceptable loss. It's easier to just delete an account than it is to try and rectify the situation. All right, that's all I have for you folks. I do advise that you do be careful when you're online. I understand there is no way that I could have prevented this because they didn't actually hack into my account. They simply copied everything and created an account that looked identical. Now, what might be a little bit interesting to you and maybe a little bit helpful is my daughter had suggested the reason why I was targeted was because of my demographic, my age, and the people that I reach out to. They were quite right in suspecting that I am not very good at using Instagram. I don't use it often enough. I have very few followers and I don't make a lot of posts. So looking at me, they realized I probably am not very savvy on the technology including they probably looked at my followers and thought maybe the same thing of many of them. Although I know that's not true, many of you are very savvy. They thought these people might be likely good candidates to reach out to to see if they could scam some money from. So that's my only thing that I can share with you is if you're going to use Instagram, be very diligent in showing that you are a savvy user. I'm not sure I'm going to start a new Instagram account up, but if I do, hopefully some of you will follow me on it. Okay, folks, that's all I have for you today. Hopefully I'll be back to you soon with a much better video.